I hit the ground in Loreto with the expectation I'd be in the water before long. The 20 minute ride to the Via del Palmar through Baja California's coastal desert is a beautiful one and left me ready to get wet. Jacques Cousteau called the Sea of Cortez the aquarium of the world and I was going to experience some of that crystal clear water as soon as I could. This is Densante Bay, home of the Via del Palmar Resort. And my goal was to hike out along the rocks to this point, an excellent snorkeling spot. The tide was out, so after a quick but sometimes challenging walk along the jagged rocks and deserted coves, I found my entry. Just found a little spot here, about a 15 minute hike from the resort. And I'm just gonna go in from the rocks over here. It looks like the water is absolutely beautiful. Time for a snorkel. So I threw on my fins and hit the water. You know it's going to be a good day when you see this many little yellow convict fish right off the bat. Because little fish bring the bigger fish. And my first never saw that before moment came right here when I came across this very large guinea fowl puffer. Guinea fowl puffers get to be around 20 inches long. And this one was at least that. Closer to two feet, definitely the largest one I've ever seen. Puffers have a reputation of being poisonous, but that's only if you eat them. So this big guy will not be on the menu anytime soon. There are several varieties of puffers here, and I was following this little bullseye puffer when out of nowhere, a baby eel sprang out and attacked him. See that? Watch it again in slow motion. Ouch, that's how fast things can change around here. There are a ton of these spotted rays here which generally seek to avoid contact. They're like nature's vacuum cleaners and the only way you'll get stung by them is if you accidentally step on them in the sandy shallows when you're entering the water. It's a good idea to shuffle your feet in the sand until you start to swim. If you do that, you'll send them scurrying for deeper water. See ya! This interesting fish is a spiny porcupine. You shouldn't touch any fish on purpose, but if you touch this puffer, he may have a pointy little surprise for you. It's a really nice little spot out here around the bend of the rocks here. Lots of really unique and interesting fish, some beautiful blue star fish, and the entrance from the beach is not hard. The sheer numbers and diversity of undersea life in the Sea of Cortez is mind-boggling. And I hope the environmental managers of this world's aquarium can keep it healthy and growing. I can only think of four words to describe it. Jacques Cousteau was right.